Hi guys, welcome to Learn Splum, where learning is fun, easy and accessible to everyone. My name is Joanna and today I am going to be giving you 5 online safety tips you will need while learning on the Learn Splum app. Firstly, we need to understand what online safety is. It is simply protecting yourself while learning online. It is being informed about the possible threats you may encounter while learning online and knowing how to avoid them. Our first tip. Do not share your private information with strangers online. This includes your house address, your phone number, and most importantly, your card details. All payments should be made on the Lensplot app or on our site. If anyone asks you to make payment through a personal account, please report such. Our second tip. Protect your passwords. Do not share your password with anyone on the app, your classmates or your teachers. If at any point you feel someone has your password, please change it immediately. Our third tip. Do not open messages or emails from strangers. A parent or guardian should be notified in case of unfamiliar or strange looking emails or messages. Hackers and fishers are always trying to steal your confidential information. Opening these emails or messages may reveal confidential information to a hacker or even put a virus on your device. Our fourth tip, never arrange to meet with someone you met online alone. While on the Lensplot app, you can make new friends. If there's a need to meet up, always inform your parents so your parents can get in touch with their parents. Meet in a public place and be escorted by your parents or a guardian. Our fifth tip. This is for parents. Monitor the suffering habits and performance of your children. As a parent or guardian, you can monitor your child's internet time and also check their analysis dashboard from time to time to ensure they are taking their courses and not spending time on other things like games. If they need to surf the internet, they can use kid search engines such as Kido or Safe Search Kit, which is like Google but for children. Well, that is it for today guys. Stay safe while learning and see you next time.